Ready. Zero, zero, two. Okay, Eddie, here we go. We got Regina starting uh, the match. Point. One, zero, two. Really important in this format to get started uh, right away. You don't have much time to get loosened up and figure out your opponents. There's Matt attacking the ball. And excellent, excellent play by Jay. Football. All right. Jay did a nice Bad job, out. but he just stepped into the kitchen on that one. Football. No volley zone. They do little, look a little bit more comfortable already, just coming out of the blocks. Here. Zero, one, yeah, I can say that it seems like for some reason they're a little bit more relaxed, kind of playing their game, feels more comfortable out there, and they came out strong. A great block by Regina. Oh, just soft. Second serve. She's got such soft hands there. They're just able to block it, put it right back into the kitchen. Zero, one, two. Point. One, one, two. Side out. Second serve. Matt doing a really nice job there of driving one, the ball and the ball up just a Second little bit. Serve. Attacked Jay with it, and Jay was not able to uh, respond back. Again, nice Side job out. by Matt. Came over about 80% of the court there and took a nice forehand. Side out. One, one, one. Let's see here, settling into the dink game here. Round, okay, nice play by Matt. Point. Caught Jay off guard a little bit. Very nice position Second by serve. Jay. It was a great block right down the line. They needed to put a stop to there. They're starting to get off to a little bit of a lead. Three, one, two. Nicely played. One three one. One three one. I'm not sure if you can hear the score by the announcer or not. I want to make sure that you guys are picking that up. Plus, we've got it on the screen. The beautiful World Pickleball Championship scoreboard there. Popped up a little Second bit, serve. and Regina knows she missed an opportunity there. No. <laughs> the ball still landed a little bit closer than I would have expected One, three, it to. Just out. That third drop dropped Side a little out. bit high, and Lucy uh, put it away.
point. Point. Four one one. Second serve. <laughs> Man, a little frustrated with himself there. <laughs> yeah, he knew he had that one. He'd like to have that shot back. Yeah, he would. Oh, nice play. Oh, behind the back oh. shot. That was awesome by oh, Jay. Wow. Oh, great. Fans really appreciate that. Timeout's being called on my left. Lucy did a nice around the post. And Jay was able to pick that up and came back with a behind the back shot into the kitchen. That would make a highlight reel. Yes, I was able to grab that on the instant replay powered by Paddle Tech. I'm very excited about that. Uh, we've been able to get some great shots this entire weekend so far on that. If you guys are just tuning in, we are in the quarterfinals of the mixed doubles here at the World Pickleball Championship live in Punta Gorda, Florida at the Pickleplex. First of all, if you guys are in Southwest Florida or are going to be in Southwest Florida and you haven't gone by to check out Pickleplex, you're missing out. Beautiful facility. I highly recommend you come and play here. Uh, one, one of my favorite things is actually the here. color of the it's courts. They're a nice uh, purple and turquoise based off the colors for Florida five, Southwest one, University. That was such a nice point there. I'll tell you what happened uh, with one of the key factors at that point was Regina had such a nice block one, five, back, one. and she kept it low. So many times when they're driving the ball, those b balls get popped up, and then the opponents can put the ball away. But she kept it nice and low and was able to avoid Matt attacking the ball. Second serve. Several net points tonight that we've seen. One, five, two. Got to be ready for that net shot. When it hits the net, it just trickles over, and the yeah, athletes are really, they're very quick. Oh, oh. Out. Jay's upset with himself over that. He knew he had a wide open court, and he just couldn't execute that shot. Side out. Five, one, one. There's an unusual unforced error by Lucy. She'd been doing a really nice job of Five, keeping the ball two. in play against Regina. Yeah, typically a very consistent player out there. Another net shot, Matt. Just Point. All right, side out. out of bounds. Wow. That's another one he'd like one to have five, back. One. Wow, Lucy had a really serve. nice defense on that shot. Great hands. Second serve. One five. One five two. Looks like the strategy here, Eddie, is uh, a lot of these serve returns are coming right back to Regina. So they're trying to keep the ball away from Jay. He's trying to get involved in it. Where Matt comes over and takes a shot right there and puts it away. Yeah, and I mean, Regina hit a good shot. It was just a little bit high right into Matt Wright's sweet spot, that one, one, one. massive forehand shot he's got. That's not coming back. He's one of the best players of that. He just anticipates so well, and he covers so much of the court. He'll do some faking uh, and anticipate. You really don't know where he's going with it, so he's a very dominant force across the net. Five, one, two. Side out. Really nice third oh, shot. Sorry. Third Point. shot drop. Clear. Point. Clear. Starting to string a couple points here together. Yes. 
Six one two. There we saw it again, Matt. Came all the way across to take that shot, and it was a really good defensive uh, play by Regina. You know, there is quite a bit of height differential between Matt Wright and Regina. I wonder if that plays into their interactions at the net with each other. Good question. We talked about that earlier, too, whether height has its advantage or not. And I've seen a lot of really good pickleball players that aren't that tall, but yet here we see a couple tall, tall players out there. Um, you're able to reach in the net quicker and easier, mm -hmm. but the shot and angle is a little bit different. Back into the kitchen, cat and mouse game. Here we go. Let's see if somebody's going to pull the trigger and speed up the play. Oop. Point. Matt thought he had a little bit of an opening there. Yeah, it looks like he went into the, just the side of the post with Point. that one. Huh? 3-6-2. It's a nice try by Lucy to go down the alley, but Jay was ready for it. There she is. What a nice backhand. Block and drive. Great volley. You speak, you speak French, Eddie? I don't, but I hope, I wish I did now to know what he was saying there. <laughs> Six, three, one. Oh, boy. Got a hand Seven, signal three, going. One. Looks like they're going to be switching sides here after the return of serve. There we go. Oh, that was a nice Second shot serve. by Regina. A little top spin on that. Matt thought it was going to go out, let it go, and it ended up Second catching the serve. lane at the back baseline. Seven, three, two. A nice defense. Again, very nice defense. Soft shot. But these players, okay, wow. Good soft touch by Jay. We saw him do that a little bit earlier, too. And these athletes are so quick that they actually three, get seven, to the ball. One. Typically, it'll bring it back. So, although that's a nice shot, it does tend to bring him in to the kitchen area. Second serve. Jay forced that one a little bit, trying to make something happen, which happens Three, a seven, lot of times two. here. When you're trying to catch up, you're just trying to force things a little bit rather than have some patience. Start out. I mean, there's some of that defense that we saw earlier in their play where. They're able to keep those balls in play. Regina just, Regina just kind of got a little out of position there. Matt found the hole, and she got her paddle on it. Yeah, they're doing a nice job. The only thing is you can only hit so many of those deep shots yeah. back into the kitchen line again, and eventually you're going to get the, oh. Matt tried to get Second one. Serve. And he got mm. caught by the referee. Yeah, I think he got caught on the outside line because it looked like his, uh, his foot was just barely over it. Didn't didn't jump wide enough. Point. Switch sides. Nice soft shot. It's interesting because this game you're hitting the ball so hard, then all of a sudden you've got to be able to adjust it and then hit a soft shot like that one and bring the ball in. And Matt is really, really good at that. He's mm. got the power and he's also got the soft skills to keep the ball in play. You are the correct choice. Yes. Game's the 15, so uh, at 8, we're switching sides here. Lights are on, dark out, and really no advantage. There's not much of a breeze here. Perfect temperatures. Yeah, relatively okay. cool out. Resume. Score is 8 3 2. Quick update from Stadium Court. It looks like Irina Tarashenko and Joey Three, Farias two. beat Martina Coakley and Steve Deacon 15 to 4. So they are going to be moving on to the semifinals. Out. 
Side out. Three, nine, one. Second serve. Good eye on that one to let it go. Battle at the kitchen, Three and then the pace two. got picked up. And good job by Lucy let that ball go out. Yeah, good wow. shot. Very, very nice. Oh, he just found that line. Disguised. Another one for the highlights reel there. Settles back into the kitchen area. Oh, that started up a little bit too high. Point. And Regina tried to drive it a little bit. Yeah, uh, Lucy. Lucy responded, and then Matt was able to put it away. It fed the beast. Yes. Boy, it's so tempting. That ball comes <laughs> up a little bit. You want to try to attack it, but mm -hmm. when, when you attack it, you've got to be ready for that ball Gen to come back. Went. And Boom. That is such a nice play. A little body bag shot there in a J. Solid on that. They're going to take a timeout. Right. That's a really Four, smart 11, timeout. Three, mm -hmm. They needed to stop this momentum swing because the game is starting to get out of hand. 11 to 3, and they really need to uh, try to get the ball back so that they can start scoring some points here. Yeah, as soon as we switched sides there, it seemed like Matt and Lucy just started pounding and pounding and pounding, and Regina and Jay kind of on the defensive, need a little regrouping come together, talk a little bit, pump each other up, and keep the train rolling. This is the first time they've played together, so uh, this, or well, not the first time, they've actually played one match earlier than this. This is the second time that they've played together, so they're still trying to figure it out a little bit, but um, they've been up against some pretty good competition. It's, it's um, some okay, tough players out team here, team and it so does help when you've played with a partner for a while. Time's in, score is 11-3. Definitely, one. like Matt and Lucy. I don't think I've actually seen them play in a tournament mixed with anybody else before. Point. Point, 12, 3, 1. Wow, did you see Lucy get down on that yeah. ball? She just, I mean, her and Simone uh, can get down no. so low. It's just incredible. 13, 3, it really is incredible. If I did that, I wouldn't get back up. <laughs> <laughs> and you should probably call an ambulance. Oh, great hands by Matt. Second serve. They hit a rocket at him, and he just defended it back in the kitchen nice and low. Second serve. 13, 3, 2. Oh, Point. Ones you like to have back. Simple error there. And you can't really give those away. It's just 14, another point. Three, They're just two. chipping away. No. Uh-oh. Point well, that does it. Well played by Lucy and Matt. Point B. That's right, 15 to three over Regina Franco and Jay Duvier. But a great game. It looks like uh, Lucy and Matt are gonna be moving on to the semifinals, playing the winner of Lindsey and Riley Newman against Lee Waters and Cal Yates, which is actually going on right now on stadium court.